Happy holiday, Steph. Number three's favorite Christmas present be? Would it be a blindfold, but that other people have to wear? SCP Reasonable. Christmas thoughts. What would happen if SCP-096 was let loose in SCP-784, the Christmas Forever Town? Would he go absolutely sicko mode, or would they overwhelm Shy Guy and convert him into a more festive version of himself? Shy Guy absolutely Four, five, wins, no contest. Pizza box that gives you your favorite pizza definitely gets abused by Foundation staff during Christmas parties, of right? Course. I mean, the staff are 100% going to have SCP. SCP-5031 playing Christmas songs on its little piano. Well, SCP-261 is used for some sick Christmas candies, right? And what yes! Would be the best SCP Christmas present that oh, come on. Why would you do that? SCP-5031. Now it's going to go sicko mode on us. Game that lets you learn anything. Uh, uh, learn how to subscribe. SCP-173 would be absolutely doomed in SCP-784, the Christmas <laughs> Forever Town, right? I mean, there's no way he could stand a chance. He's going to be getting turned into a snowman for sure. SCP I mean, there's a lot of people to look at it, but it's still not a great plan. Eagle man will stalk its prey for days before attacking them in their homes. Do you think you could hang up a picture of SCP-096 as a defense uh, against him? I mean, as long as you don't accidentally look at one of the pictures, he's bound to, right? That's a big you if! Shy guy I think Shy Guy could murk the Yule Man, but not before you get murked. Bad plan. Forever Town? No matter what, that's gotta be a horrible... It's too populated. The Yule Man wouldn't visit it. Even Ikea set up Christmas decorations, and are they... I hope so. Related? If Thanos sent SCP-096 to a different dimension or to the end of time, would he have beaten Shy Guy or would Shy Guy be stronger than the Infinity Gauntlet and find a way back? SCP I mean, unless there's some sort of other dimensional or time rift, I think 096 is pretty stuck. Strength and can sense danger. I mean, he was even bitten by an anomalous spider that breached containment. How many super Anomalous, but not an SCP if it's not on the wiki. That's the technical thing. And what would their containment chambers be like? Would Batman ever... All the ones that are anomalous would be. The world's greatest detective? And would he see them as... Probably. Villains or people just trying to protect humanity? Would Why not Bruce both? Banner be a foundation scientist, or would they try to contain him since he's the Hulk? Or would depends on the story. Like Doctor Bobo or Doctor Bright. After you subscribe, tell me. When you think about it, there's probably a lot of SCPs that'd be Avengers if given the chance. You but we're not going to give them the chance because we keep them in their boxes. Doing Avengers stuff, dude. Invisible with a knife tail? I mean, Iron that'd be cool. SCP five thousand. Five thousand just kind of keeps you alive and makes people not notice you. It doesn't have a lot of offense. Also means half of all SCPs are getting blip too but you're surviving if you happen to be in something like scp-106's pocket dimension right Doctor Strange i don't think the infinity gauntlets mess with the multiverse so i, I think the pocket dimension would keep you safe cp-3008 is maybe just a portal to an entire ikea mirror dimension which is why it goes on i mean you forever. could interpret this it like that to know if the hulk was in the same room as scp-426 the toaster <laughs> that makes you talk as if you're a toaster would it still make him say i'm a toaster or would it make him say something like hulk is a toaster no it'd be like you toaster shiny how strong is Superman's neck? Would he be able to withstand SCP-173 trying to snap him? Or would I don't think it matters because Superman's X-ray vision can see through his eyelids, so it doesn't even matter if he blinks. See, the Justice League is just another group of interests that has SCPs like the Flash, Aquaman, and anomalous items like the Lasso of Truth. And the that's how I'd classify it. Would the SCP Foundation make the Justice League a sort of MTF squad that just uses Thaumiel SCPs? If we could, that contain other SCPs. Lex Luthor would absolutely. That's Charles Xavier. Scheming menace to try to get on the O5 council, right? Would he be able to uh, do it? This user wants probably. to know, would Batman let the SCP Foundation contain Superman? Depends on how Martha he's feeling that day. What would SCP-173 do in a room with Ant-Man? He'd basically be trying to snap the neck of a tiny little thing jumping around everywhere. SCP-173 so SCP moves faster than the human eye can see, problem. so Ant-Man would get squished. Would get up to with the Ant-Man suit. SCP-682 oh, is gangster. Lord, not again. Right, shrinks down and crawls up his ass. Astoundingly, 682 like could adapt to that, sadly. Marvel. But would they all be rounded up by the Foundation and locked away? Magnet Hell yeah! Very angry SCP. Last short, I asked what would happen if the Hulk was in a room with SCP-426, the Toaster that makes you say I'm a toaster. But what happens when Groot is in a room with four? So same with Hulk, it just adapts to your language. So Groot would do the I am a toaster, but in Groot speak. Tell me. Would SCP-173 absolutely dominate red light, green light, or completely? <laughs> Worst done? party game ever. It moves faster than sight. The second you turn your head, snap. Nine four for a cup of the most average drink. What would it taste like? Your mom. Oh! Breaks ever occur? Would deep sea fish even ever know about it? If and sunlight SCP doesn't reach, then it doesn't affect them. Other SCPs like SCP-049 or 682 that they are also toasters. I mean, it doesn't make you think you're the toaster. It just changes how you talk about it in the first person. It's not. Doesn't work like that. SCP-096. 
I mean, it, pictures, it's, videos, it's, it's, literal it's, it's, depictions, it's, it's, but not artistic ones like 3D printing. What would you do if you were stuck in a room with SCP-173? A lot probably of probably die. Just blink one eye at a time, but this actually <laughs> won't work because of the smell of his fecal matter constantly making your eyes water and forcing you to blink. So I would just climb on top of a. I've never considered it like that. Something. Everyone forgets that he can't snipe your neck if you're too high up. And no offense, but SCP-173 can't jump. SCP It'll just knock over the thing you're, you're standing on. If you were stranded on a desert island with two SCPs, what would they be? SCP-109 hmm. can provide you with infinite water, and SCP-458 can provide you with infinite pizza. So I'd go with those. Not a bad plan. I'll, I'll go with that. Just save up all the extra crust I don't eat to make a boat to escape. R What's the most raft. SCP? I'd have to say SCP-5031. I just really love the idea of a monster who's... I do love that good boy. really just wants to cook and play the piano. It's a great story about how we used to mistreat dreams, anomalies and it was bad. After you subscribe, let me know. If SCP-173 was stuck in a block of ice, could he even get to you if you blinked, or would the block of Well, it can't move through a solid wall, so I think 173 wouldn't be able to get to you, but would it would be a lot of energy to maintain that ice block. in the Hanged King's play if he was given a copy of the script since he's a humanoid? Would I don't think 096 is sentient or sapient enough to be forced to participate. SCP-173 has a set of false eyes on him like a beautiful butterfly. But does hmm. that imply there's a natural predator to peanuts? SCP I think it's a bit of a stretch. Do most SCPs even care that they're in containment like yes SCP most but not all want to escape loves the fact that nobody ever looks at him and, and breaks out every SCP time someone sees its face escape too if ever given a chance to breach containment. 173 wants SCP to go snappy snappy next all the many times do you think the scp foundation has seen something like a spider that lives underground instead of in a web or insanely large and lazy rodents and thought to themselves a uh, new anomalous entity like the fire breathing i see what you're getting at so it's not uncommon that we find something that's like brand new and mistake it for something Anomalous, but it's not as common as you think. SCP-662 is a butler that can perform, quote, any menial task. But who defines menial? AI is smart enough to easily write... It's not that picky, own. definitionally. So 662 make a website for you or hack the government? This he could, with Squarespace, know, not sponsored. They crumble if you put him in space since he's made of That's concrete, only when the oxygen is pulled out of the molecules of the concrete, so no, it'd be fine. Be just fine. After you subscribe, tell me. What would be the most helpful SCP? Ignoring the obvious ones like SCP-343, which is literally God, apparently. I'd have to say SCP-662. He's a butler that can That's a good one. Anything, 2295 is pretty useful, and 2719 is extremely it, useful if you can nice understand food, how it generally works. Generally, be a pretty cool dude to talk to. SCP Deep Thoughts. What is the scariest SCP? Subnautica trained me to become deeply afraid of the ocean, and for good reason. So I'd have to say SCP-3000, because a 900-kilometer long... 271 8 is also pretty horrifying if you have the classification level to read it. Want to see existence. And I read SCPs for fun. What SCP would you make if you had the chance? I don't know. It sounds really dumb, but make? maybe something like SCP-9. Well, I've made some SCPs if you want to check my author page, like which is linked SCP to my bio. And it just becomes an Don't forget to sub to the YouTube channel on your way there. The shy guy just becomes a little baby that gets mildly irritated. The chip of fire. I don't know. It sounds hilarious. After you subscribe, let me know. The Hulk be able to smash SCP-173, or would Peanut win? They both don't allow. I think of so because SCP it's just concrete. So would the smash. SCP Foundation try to contain the Infinity Stones, or just leave them be since they're basically a part of the natural universe? I mean, yeah, they do magic things, things, so we try to contain them. Although Cap the idea of like the Men in Black or the SCP Foundation in a Marvel universe, universe where everything's out in the open already—it's weird. Interest. If the Sheaf of Papers was the real SCP-001 and the Avengers existed in the SCP universe, then does that mean all comics? Comic books were originally written by SCP-001. God, I'm an SCP author, and I would know, never want to talk to Deadpool. Ah, do uh, like the Venom, meta stuff. Carnage, I mean, they're basically like scp Yeah, we, five, again, right? we After contain the anomalous okay. stuff. If you looked away from SCP-173 and snapped your own neck, would he leave you be or snap your neck again just to make sure? He'd be SCP unalive. That would be the end of it. Hear me out. What if SCPs went to school? SCP-069-J, Sisters of Cheyenne Point. in a room with a guy that's allergic to peanuts. What if Nothing. Hypothetically, you put SCP-096 in boiling water for months. Would he get Why would you want Shy Guy Stew? What if SCP-173 didn't look at SCP-173? It doesn't have eyes. Oh, come on. This one's not uh, even a question. Damn, monster I wonder, fuckers. If you can eat SCP-173, do he attack? Or it's made of concrete. Stay? How old is Shy Guy? Old? It's not like we can ask it. SCP Foundation fiction or real? I need answers. That is classified. What's the coolest SCP object? I think the Mount Everest SCP, because... 
because it's a bunch of frozen bodies. They are chill AF. <laughs> oh, but for non-dad joke answer, I also like SCP-3108, the nerfing gun. I think it's pretty cool that you can just shoot it and pew, make things worse. Good, bad, doesn't really matter. They're anomalous. They go in the box. I think it depends on perspective, really. Except for the Yule Man. He's definitely evil. And yeah, he's a dick. What gives off SCP energy that isn't an SCP? Cabin in the Woods and hashtag Renew Inside Job. Oh, I like Undertale. We're having a discussion on SCP Twitter right now. What kind of character energy does Dr. Sherman have? Asgore Dad energy, Metaton Show Off energy, Papyrus Goober energy, or Burger Pants Burnt Out energy? If SCP-939 wore pants, would he wear them like this or like this? SCP B, obviously. SCP-662 is an anomalous butler that will perform any menial task you ask of him. Do you mm -hmm. think he can just destroy any other SCP like the hard-to-destroy lizard or peanut? If you convince him, it's easy to do. He is invincible. You can't trick him. He, he has limitations, so it wouldn't work like that. Take out somebody they don't like is to just fax them an image of SCP-096, right? Uh, so, yeah, it seems like a good idea in theory, but then you have a picture floating around out there and someone has to go get it. That's pretty risky. Not a great plan. Any door in the world. What happens if you put it in SCP-914, the clockwork machine, and try to... We're not going to do that test because it might destroy the anomaly and then we can't test it. This user wants to know, if SCP-3008 is infinite, who pays for the electrical bills? If they sell the meatballs to our dimension. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.